Hi, it's Pavel with the C++ exercise and we will calculate membership fees increase which is a simple looping exercise and here's the assignment a country club which currently charges two and a half thousand dollars per year for membership has announced it will increase its membership fees by four percent each year for the next six years write a program that uses a loop to display the projected rates for the next six years. So remember, it will increase 4% out of 2,500 the first time. The next time, it won't be 2,500, it will be 2,500 plus the 4% on top of that. So in other words, it's accumulated uh, increase. All right, but as to our, uh, for our purposes, it's basically doesn't, you know, same loop. So, uh, I will declare a constant, which means uh, an, a number that will not going to change. That's the percentage, right? Uh, that's that's given. It's four percent every year. It doesn't have to be constant. You know, you can always just use the actual number. Like I said before many times, I prefer to use the variables that hold the number and constant is this is uh, what constants are all, all about so uh, and uh, I will need a float for membership uh, wow what did I what happened there uh, float membership and I initialize it to 2500 that's the first year now this cannot be constant because membership will be changing you know by 4% within the loop. So, let's do the loop. Integer i equals 1. That's the year, year 1. i is less than or equal 6. Now again, this can be a constant. Constant integer years and initialize to 6. In fact, let's go with that. Again, it's the same reason for, like the increase. The, the, this is given. We calculate 6 years. But if you wanted to calculate 10, all I have to do is come here and type 10. And this will not break. It will pick up the number associated with the variable years, of course. Alright, so... Uh, and, let's, of course, we need to add 1 to uh, to the to our index, to our i variable. And how do you calculate a membership? Well, so membership equals membership plus the yearly increase, which is membership times increase. So this will give you the percentage or the well, increases 4% out of membership and you add it to the current membership. And you'll store it in the same variable. No, no reason to, you know, uh, declare another variable. If you wanted to reuse this one, then you would have to declare uh, a new variable to hold the calculation. I don't, because at the end, membership will not equal 2,500. It will equal uh, the sum of the uh, six years of increase plus the current me the membership it is to the 2,500. But I need, don't need to preserve it for this particular exercise, so I'll just store it in the same uh, variable. And let's output the, uh, the result. I'll uh, make it... Uh, year in like a little tabular format so year i which is one at the first uh, in the first iteration the second it will be year two then year three and so forth so in year, year i fees are how many how much uh, well the membership the membership now holds the member increased membership value uh, or the increased membership monetary uh, value. It's not 2,500 anymore. 
it's 2500 plus four uh, percent out of 2500 so uh, membership and end of line and that's that very simple you know <laughs> literally what would you write like 10 lines not even so um, let's let's make sure it works all right so the year one fees are two thousand six hundred dollars all right it's two thousand five hundred you know what let me do the uh little calculator here just to make sure so it's two thousand five hundred divided by hundred times uh four four percent which is hundred plus two thousand five hundred obviously is two thousand six hundred now you calculate years uh, i mean fees from two thousand six hundred dollars so two thousand six hundred that's one percent is twenty six plus four plus two thousand six hundred two thousand seven hundred and four there you go now you calculate four percent from two thousand seven hundred and four and so forth until you hit this year six and the final result is uh, in six years the uh, fees will be three thousand one hundred and sixty three dollars and three cents all right so there you have it very simple and i hope it helps you and see you next time take care